People say that during World War II, someone once shot straight through an enemy sniper's scope and killed them. To test that rumor, Adam bought four modern rifle scopes and built a gel dummy to act as the shooter. They started the tests at 100 yards. Jimmy went first. His shots were very accurate and hit the scopes dead on. Yet the dummy wasn't harmed. The scopes didn't get pierced. They absorbed or deflected the bullets. Adam ran a second round, firing directly into the front of the scope. But the outcome was the same. No penetration. They then brought in a professional sniper to try, but again, the scopes held. After three tests, the bullets hadn't come close to injuring the dummy. With only one scope left, they switched to closer range shots. If that failed, the rumor would be debunked. This time, the impact was much stronger, and the scope was blasted off, but still not pierced. They realized a scope isn't a simple one-inch tube. It's made from multiple lenses and components. Those lenses aren't especially tough, but their arrangement can deflect a bullet, making straight-through penetration unlikely. So the team tracked down the exact rifle model, mount, and scope described in the rumor and tested again. This time, the bullet did go through the scope and struck the dummy in the eye entering about two inches into the head. So, it turns out a sniper can, under the right circumstances, shoot through a scope and kill the person behind it.